health professionals or effectiveness of the vaccine. We have to impart it. The other one is it is the source for a reason. It is the starting point for a reason. By the way, this, this epidemic investigation is a mini research by itself. It's a reason. The other one is it also creates an opportunity for training of professionals. For training. The other is it is used for the concern of political and the, the, the public and the legal concern. Okay? As the, the United Nations declaration or as the law of WHO, every individual should be protected from getting a disease. This is a legal concern. So this is why we uh, perform epidemic investigation. So during the epidemic uh, management, what should be the probability action in, in the outbreak? Okay? Outbreak in Taka, Yoka, excessive occurrence in Taka, Argamitra, Manu Jetka Ojet. Investigating on a more control. What's our, our priority? Hmm? It is based on the mode of transmission and the causative The mode of transmission and the causative To prioritize whether we do investigation or we, we implement the control measures, it determines the mode of transmission and the causative Let me now, for example, if we now, if we now, the causative agent and the source or mode of transmission, if both are now, which can be? Then first, controlling is first. Then. This, this three plus is highest priority. And one is higher priority. We know the causative agent is, again, we know mode of transmission. Once we know the mode of transmission, we have to control, we have to prevent the disease. The priority is it. If, for example, we know the cause of agendas and we don't, we don't know the mode of transmission, what will be first? Investigation. Without knowing the mode of transmission, it is difficult to control. So we have to investigate to know the mode of transmission. The mode of transmission. But, for example, if we don't know the cause of agendas, we don't know the cause. We have the causes, virus, bacteria, protozoa, and the lab. We don't know. Or we don't know the risk factors again. But we know the mode of transmission. So what will be there? We can control. Both at the same time. Okay. To know the positive agent, we have to implement the investigation. Isn't it? Yes. And again, the mode of transmission is well now. So we have to control the disease. We have to control it. So both are implemented parallel. If both is not now, what will be there? Clearly, we have to investigate to now both cause the world transmission. So setting priority for the outbreak, for, for taking action against the outbreak is based on the source of our mode of transmission and the cause of the So there are the steps to investigate the, the, the epidemics.